there was a small river flowing across a deep jungle. A handsome deer lived in the jungle. He drank water from the river and grazed in the jungle. The river was the home of a giant crocodile and his friends. He wanted to hunt the deer and eat him but could not find a way. One day, the deer was grazing on the bank of the river. Suddenly, he noticed a tree full of red berries hanging. He also saw other animals eating those berries and having fun. He realized how sweet the berries were and wanted to cross the river. He was aware that the river was infested with big crocodiles and one of them watched him drinking water. He cannot swim and will surely fall prey in the hands of that giant crocodile. But his longing for the berries grew even bigger. The clever deer thought of a plan. One day, he was grazing in the bank. He called the crocodile with his beautiful voice. The crocodile responded immediately. What do you want? The king of this jungle has invited all the crocodiles to dinner. He is happy how you all protect the river from other animals. In honor of the crocodiles, this gala dinner has been arranged, but the king needs a head count. He has given me the duty to count and tell how many of you will attend the dinner party. The crocodile was delighted to learn that the king admired all of them. He called all his friends to one place and said the same. Everyone was happy. The deer, maintaining a safe distance from the crocodiles, said, I will count the crocodiles. Please line up one by one. I will walk on each of you and ensure no one is missed. Nobody will move and leave his place. The crocodiles believed the ingenious plan of the clever deer. They lined up from one bank to the other. The deer stepped on the first one and counted one. He then hopped on the other one and counted two. In this way, he easily crossed the river and hopped on the other bank. After reaching the other side, he said, Thank you for your patience. I have finished my counting. From this day onwards, this side of the river will be my home. The crocodiles were infuriated. They started rumbling in the river in anger. The deer laughed and went to enjoy a delicious snack of sweet berries from the trees. The clever deer story moral in English is that intelligence is what matters sometimes. It can outsmart strength when needed. The deer easily overcame the obstacles with his presence of mind. He took a risk by considering that the crocodiles were dumb to believe his plan. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel for more moral tales like this one. Thank you so much for watching and supporting us. Once upon a time, there was a very dense forest. In the forest, there lived a cunning yet dumb fox. Everybody was taking a nap after they had lunch. Mr. Fox was very hungry as he didn't have anything. He could not find any prey for him to eat. Oh! My stomach! He wandered around the deep forest for food. Suddenly, he saw his friend Mr. Tortoise on a river bank and quietly went near him and caught him. Mr. Tortoise was afraid and did not know what to do. But he was not able to eat it. Now can you tell why? It was so because the tortoise's shell is very hard and tight. At that moment, the tortoise had a bright idea to save himself from the cunning fox. Mr. Fox, you may soak me in the water, my shell will soften and then you can happily eat me. The fox was very foolish. 
So, he believed the tortoise and said, Okay. He kicked the tortoise into the water. The tortoise slipped away from the fox and swam to safety. Thus, he was saved. The fox was so stupid he did not even realize he was getting fooled by the tortoise. The tortoise laughed loudly. Being smart and honest is better than trying to trick others. It's important to use our brains wisely and be truthful, just like the clever tortoise did in the story. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Thank you so much.